It was a cold day for sure. Even with some sunshine outside, we didn't see much in the way of any clouds throughout the day. Uh, we're taking a live look now from South or uh, Honda of Lincoln, looking to the southwest. And you can see the sun is getting very close to setting right now. Uh, but even with Lots of sunshine. Highs only made it into the upper teens this afternoon. We hit 18 degrees in Lincoln. That was after a morning low down to 2 degrees below zero. Currently sitting at 16 degrees at the airport at 16 degrees in the northwest corner of the county. 16 degrees on the south side of the county. Head out towards Seward. It's 15 degrees. It's 15 right now in Milford and 16 degrees in Friend. 16 as well in Beatrice, 13 a little cooler in Central City, 14 in Columbus, and we've got 16s from Grand Island to Kearney, 17 as well as in Hastings, as well as in Aurora, which by the way, Aurora this morning got down to 7 degrees below zero. Not a lot of wind out there this afternoon, which is not necessarily a bad thing, so we don't have as much of a wind chill to talk about as we did yesterday when wind chills were mainly below zero. It currently feels like it's 4 in Columbus, 7 in Grand Island, and it feels like it's 3 in Kearney. There are just a couple of clouds back out to the west. There's a chance some of these will begin to move in later on this evening, but I think for the most part we're going to stay mainly clear. Air temperatures as we go through the overnight hours will be dropping down to just below zero. Wind chills, because there will be just enough wind out there to create a wind chill, that's what we're looking at here, goes to two below in Lincoln at by 10 o'clock. So we go through the overnight hours where the winds pick up maybe just a little bit, we may start to see them dropping even more towards Seward, York and Columbus, dropping as low as 15 degrees below zero. I think in the capital city we're talking wind chills tomorrow morning anywhere from three below to about eight degrees below zero. Actual air temperatures dropping to one below in Lincoln, four above in Seward, three above in York, and one below for low in Columbus. Now this is looking at air temperatures for tomorrow. Clouds will quickly be on the increase through the morning hours. By afternoon we'll see mostly cloudy skies if not overcast skies. By noon temperatures will be a little, little bit warmer into the low 20s. As we head towards the afternoon our temperatures will continue to go up. Uh, temperatures likely getting up to right around 30 to 31 degrees as we head towards the afternoon. So Lincoln will continue the streak of temperatures below freezing. I believe we're at 42 hours as of this hour. Uh, so high of 31 in Lincoln, 31 in Beatrice, 31 in New York, up to 33 degrees in Hastings. Winds tomorrow out of the south 8 to 16 with some occasional gusts to 25 miles per hour will give us wind chill values likely into the upper teens during the afternoon. But there is warmer weather coming our way. On Saturday we'll start to see some warmer temperatures coming. We'll see highs in the upper 30s to lower 40s. And on Sunday as a weather system passes just off to our east, uh, we'll likely see our temperatures rebounding back into the mid 40s by afternoon. Although we'll be playing with some sunshine and clouds and a mix of it throughout the day. Sunday afternoon. Seven day forecast up to 42 degrees on Saturday, down to 27 degrees on Sunday. So temperature Sunday morning warmer than what they are today. Sunday afternoon, I think it looks to be pretty decent. 46 degrees. Another weather system comes in on Monday. It's going to bring clouds. It's going to bring a chance for a few snow flurries. And also it's going to bring some colder temperatures back behind it. Down to six degrees Tuesday morning, a high of 18 on Tuesday afternoon. So similar to today. And then low temperatures by next Wednesday down to five below. Then we start warming things back up into the 40s again Thursday, Friday and Saturday of next week. So not looking too bad once we get past tonight and we get past Tuesday and Wednesday morning. Uh, temperatures for the most part hanging out just above normal.